furries are people that have a vested interest in anthropomorphism, which is basically animals with human characteristics. It's mostly all online, but then you get to know the, the fursonas in person, and they're just as sweet as they are online, they really are. I used to work in television. If I had a break, I'd be on like Tumblr looking at fursuits. During the summer, like I kind of worked on my first head, got it finished, and I was actually really impressed with my first one, so I thought, Let's give it a go. Let's try it. A lot of furries have one particular character that is kind of a representation of them or who they would like to be or something that has all their perfect qualities and none of their negative, etc. A male customer um, asked me if I could create breasts for his suit. <laughs> so, like, it's a lot of weird and wonderful, but I mean, that's that's somebody expressing expressing themselves through you know their character. People think that we're in like all these sexual things with our fursuits and I mean for some people that might be true because I mean you can take anything and make it sexual but for most of us like it's just for fun. My persona is Fixie the fox. Fixie is just me I, she's just like if I was a giant purple fox it would just be me. Whereas some people kind of like, if they're really, really shy, their persona might be really out there and crazy. But I am just literally the same. This is Fixie reporting. In terms of like group politics, it's just a very free and open space. I find that a lot of furries kind of fall into the homosexual kind of category. I identify as bisexual, whether you're gay, straight, or if you're black or white or anything, because you have this costume on, it takes all of that away. And there's no stigma attached to you. No debates on eyelids with who you are, what, where you come from, which are straight, gay, trans, doesn't matter. It's just, you know, it's just, you're into this and I'm into this too. So it's a weird dichotomy actually of seeing someone in whose persona or character is this happy-go-lucky, you know, disney kind of, wolf and then you meet the person and it's the shy, reserved, quiet boy or girl. I just love the creativity. I love meeting new people. It's just brilliant to be a part of.